Corruption allegations have once again hit the Marabastat Home Affairs Office. Some officials are allegedly soliciting bribes for processing visa and asylum applications. ANN7 reporter Kani Mapanga has more. A family is distraught after an incident of corruption at the Home Affairs Refugee Centre in Marabastad. This after a trip to renew an asylum permit turned into a nightmare. A certain guy called me by the name of Alex. He said he's a Home Affairs official. He said, yes, how can I help you? He said, okay, I'm informing you that uh, your wife has been arrested. He said, what for? Then he's an illegal immigrant. He said, how can you say illegal immigrant? Why is she has been renewing this thing for the past seven years. And then he said, that's what I'm telling you. So for me to do a favor to release her, she has to pay a fine. I said, a fine for what? And then how am I going to get a receipt? Because I understand if, you, if I pay a fine, that's an admission of guilt. Then you have to give me my receipt. I have to get a copy. Anonymous's wife has been renewing her asylum permit for the past seven years at this home affairs located in Marabastad. She arrived recently to renew her permit once again and was arrested. This was when an alleged home affairs official contacted Anonymous to pay a 1,500 rand fine to secure his wife's release. A series of text messages show the alleged home affairs official requesting 1,500 rand from Jack in order to release his wife from the Lindela Deportation Centre in Krugersdorp. Jack also provided a proof of payment, showing he sent the money. After the money was sent, the alleged official was nowhere to be found. If there are individuals in home affairs that are um, trying to solicitate bribes, please inform the Department of Home Affairs. We have a, a unit that's designed to deal with those people. If there are individuals outside of, of, of government trying to do that, please inform us again so we can work with the um, South African Police Services and bring those people to book. Jack recently received another call from a different number stating that the money deposited was too little. The Department of Home Affairs is currently investigating the case while his wife was deported from Lindela Deportation Centre. Despite efforts by the Department of Home Affairs to better its Marabastad Centre through its new paperless system, corruption still looms by frequently rearing its ugly head. Kani Mapanga, ANN7, Pretoria.